As the sun rose on April 9th, Robert E. Lee still clung to the belief his war was not over. Hopefully, Lee thought, there was only a thin line of Union cavalry ahead of him that he could smash through, find supplies and rations, and then turn south to march to North Carolina to continue the fight. But now, as the sun continued to rise, Lee's hopes were dashed by the arrival of thousands of Union infantry, including United States colored troops, who had marched most of the night to block his way south. By 8 a.m., Lee knows his war is over and sends a letter to Grant.